Gotta keep it real. <laughs> okay. Um, Scoop grew to like me. Yeah, um, you know, Scoop was a part of the trolling thing with Tea Time and all them earlier this year. Um, when we started hanging out with, when I started hanging you know, Chef Foxy's live scoop group, scoop girl liking for me. Um, all the shit she was talking in the Discord, the freaky stuff. I was intrigued. She was kind of cute. Uh, she was too young for me. I think she's like 25. She's a bit too young for me. That's like juvenile to me. And um, we would talk on the phone. And I could tell on the phone she was a little inexperienced. And that kind of turned me on. So I would talk her through. Um, she would talk to me and I would talk her through big O's orgasms and um I, I noticed how geek she was about it that she's not like that so um i noticed that she would lie for my attention to get my attention and stuff like that she would do just about her damnness to just keep it and all that stuff um i learned during the phone sex like the video sex that she would tell me to do certain things like choke yourself put this hand on your clit um grab your thigh on this and i'm like i would need six hands and i'm like this isn't making sense and i soon realized that she's never been with a woman in person she's never had an in-person girlfriend she's never even had a kiss from a girl i said sweetheart i don't you, you're probably not even gay and you don't even know it um, you haven't even experienced to know if you like it or not um also when i started dating Bree, she was like she don't care she'd be in poly with us and i'm like i was doing everything at this point to just get rid of her because She's like a kid to me, you know, um, she grew a, a dislike for Bree. She would do petty stuff towards her. I, I wasn't feeling that. Um, she was getting a bit crazy. I won't go into details about the other stuff that happened at the end, but she was getting to be a bit obsessive. And I blamed myself for that because I was participating in it. Um, I learned later that at some point she pursued tea time. She pursued Chitonia. She pursued a, she was pursuing a lot of people behind the scenes. At this point, she just didn't care. She just wanted somebody. And I was like, maybe you have a deeper issue. Um, Chef told me that she tried to pursue tea time and I was disgusted. Like, I can't be your type, baby. Or something's mentally just going on. Well, that's, that's all over the place. That's, that's all over the place. Yeah. Yeah, so she's back in Tea Time's platform now. They're back good on good terms. Hopefully, T gives her a chance. I think they both need someone. Honestly, I do. Um, and that's it. But yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. She was too young for me. Sweet girl, but she's just she's too young. And an experience. Okay. I need you guys to be very experienced before y'all be messing with HB. Okay then. No newbies, okay. Um, 